let's call the meetings to order and kind of get through the <coughs> road stuff. How are we going? Here. Deborah Carlson? Here. David Friedman? Here. We're waiting for Ed Goodale. Gail Listener? Here. John Satter? Here. Steve Ross? Here. And? Ed Goodale. Sneak <laughs> in. Um, before we get to the item that is uh, scheduled for tonight, we have two other things. First, we have a large crowd here. Is anyone from the public? Is there anyone from the public who has something they want to say to us that isn't on the agenda? Okay. Okay. Nobody. So, um, next item is approval of the minutes for the August 3, 2015. Public hearing. Um, anybody have any comments or is there a motion? Move we approve as submitted. Is there a second? Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay, so that's approved. So we've gotten ourselves to the, the schedule item on the agenda, which is a public hearing to consider a request of Annette and John Janowick, 225 Silver Road, for a west side yard setback plane and garage door width variation for a front attached garage and a northwest rear second floor addition. Um, everybody who's going to be speaking from the audience on this should raise their hand and be sworn in. I swear to tell the whole truth and nothing but the truth in the matter about to be heard. Thank you. All right, so whoever wants to tell us why, you, oh, let me go, I asked uh, actually, this morning, but John, have we gotten any, uh, the notice, I gather the neighbors have been notified. They have been notified, there's been no contact or questions at all. Okay. All right, well, whoever wants to tell us why we should do it, go up to the podium and tell us who you are, and then um, make your pitch. Hi guys, I'm Lisa Rizzolo of LA Rizzolo Architects. Uh, my client, John, uh, has bought a house four months ago. Mm -hmm. Um, it's a RA zone. It's a 50 foot lot though, so we've run into lots of problems. It's also the rear yard, if you look at the site plan, um, drops off really quickly into the ravines between their house and uh, Lake Shore Country Club. So there's a one car a, a detached garage in the back right now that came, that's sitting, the whole house is sitting in the west setbacks and the east setbacks. Um, it's, a hundred and some feet off the front yard with a 50 foot setback. So we've hit, um, we can't build, we can't add on to the garage. There's no room because of the ravine. And uh, the driveway is about 10 feet wide getting past it. So we're proposing to put a garage in the front, attached but far away from the house in the, in the front, 50 feet off the property line. The problem again is with a 50 foot lot with 12 foot setbacks. Um, we need to, we can't get a side loaded garage in and a two car garage to pull into the garage. So we're front loading it. So we need a front door set, uh, variance. We're trying to push the garage as far to the west as we can. So we're getting the west side yard set back. Then in the back of the house, um, most of the house is two stories. There's one small portion that's one story and we're trying to put a master bathroom over it. And just by adding over the existing footprint, we're sitting in the west side yard and we're cutting off some water. Um, which hit right at the west side where we're, where the existing house is, we've got about eight feet and then we have the ravine. So, so John, which side uh, is um, the, the neighbor sort of combining two lots? To the east. Okay. So they're not likely to complain if we get more space. But, um, um, That's me. <laughs> possibly on the west, somebody could write by suppose, but they've not appeared to do that. No, that's correct. And by the time we put this addition on the rear of the house, there is um, no house facing it at that point. The house is pulled much further ahead than this house is. Anybody have any questions? Hey, Lisa, was there a south elevation? Included in any of the materials that you provided to you. It's just the front of the house. Um, I thought there was. 
Page nine. It's a photograph. Is there any elevation that shows from the street looking at the house, which would show where the new garage is? Um, no, I did. I, I drew it. I did not include the package. Sorry about that. But what? Just another thing. We put it to the west because um, we have to attach it to the house for building codes, and we can't attach it to the east because of the bay window on the front of the house. But it would be really difficult. So we don't have any kind of rendering showing us like what the garage is going to look like. You should have. <coughs> Page four. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Yeah. So with the garage, we our plan is to it has a Hawthorne concrete tile roof. The house does. We've been doing research, and we're either gonna match that or we'll replace the roof on the existing house with a shingle roof and put a shingle roof on the garage but the brick will match and hopefully we'll, we'll, uh, we'll detail it exactly like the house is. And one of the renderings on page three is just a, a little hint of a new roof walkway to the proposed garage. So the attached garage is attached by way of a walkway. Per building above, yes. We can't put garages in the front yard without them being attached. Is that is that like a trellis? Is that well, um, we were we require at least a, a three foot wide uh, roof connection, mm -hmm. solid roof connection. It can be open underneath, or they can close it if they wanted money. to underneath. Okay. Yeah, these guys are working with their landscape architect, and so we haven't quite got there, but we're doing it. So how is the house going to then line up with the house to the west? Isn't the house to the west close to It's the very street? close to the street. Right. Right. So what? So how are you lining up? Are you going to be similar at that point? The garage? Yeah, your garage. Um, the garage will be slightly, I believe, slightly ahead of it, but it will be a one-story space. And the, garage, the house to the west is a two-story house, so we're keeping the profile low. Um, at the street, it's probably about three feet higher than where the garage would be elevation wise. Um, does that answer your question? I don't know. I mean, I'm not exactly sure. I didn't measure the house next uh -huh. we're standing there. We will be next to it. Yeah, no, I just remember because when I drove by the house, I saw you were set back rather far, and the house to the west was very close to the street, and I was just wondering if we were going to be, you know, aligned similarly, or so relatively. Relatively, yes. Anybody else on the board get a question? The board is very emotional. I'll just... Should they be taken separately, or are they separate? You know, not unless we think we have problems. I would think, uh, you know, they've made a proposal that we all have experiences, but with a single plan. I don't know what happened with their plan. We tried to bust it up, but probably nothing good. Just a you know, comment. I, you know, I'm troubled by <coughs> putting a garage in the front yard <coughs> like this. Um, but you know, I understand the problems of the 50 foot lot. Uh, right. and the setback requirements near our age, so. Um, no, much. obviously we never want to put it in the product we don't have to, unless it's yeah. a tech and tech house, you know? We yeah, like there you go. Yeah, all right. Yeah. We, we have approved in the past you know, variances for residents who did not have a two-car garage who were looking to create yeah. that. Yeah. There's just so many issues on this lot, mm -hmm. and physical issues. <clears throat> And in the house itself, being able to create a more functional master bath seems a important basic request that we grant it to other people. And no one's complaining. So, we have a motion. Is there a second? Second. Is your motion? Was it my motion? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't actually 
Motion, but I will. Okay. Uh, All right. I'll second. Okay. Carlson? Yes. Friedman? Yes. Middale? Yes. Lister? Yes. Sater? Yes. Ross? Yes. And Rowan? Aye. Cool. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, good luck with your project. <laughs> Second. It would be, yes. Thank you.